thought my jokes were bad. Way to move on. <laughs> Gangsta Grizzly! Grizzly! As we proceed to give you what you need. 2010 motherfuckers. Bring that money in, motherfuckers. Everything comes to an end. There is no tomorrow. There is no tomorrow. There is no tomorrow. What's going on, YouTube? We back in the Low Key Cave, Keyshawn Nine's YouTube page, aka Mr. Low Key, and we back with another trailer reaction. This time we got Uma, Uma. Is it like what it says, Uma? Um, this is supposed to be produced by Sam Raimi, so of course it's going off the gate horror. So it definitely looked like it's going to be something interesting. I don't know what's going on in this. I just seen that it's produced by Sam Raimi, and Sony is going to be releasing this in theaters March 18th. So obviously it's going to have something like I said to do with some horror. Being that Sam Raimi, the last thing I seen from horror with Sam Raimi was uh, was it? It was that movie with the devil. Something about devils, something, something, something. Y'all know what I'm talking about with the girl, and she uh, do something with the gypsies or something. Anyway, let's go ahead and jump into this new um, horror trailer. As far as called Uma, it's, that's the one I think it's called Uma or Uma, something like that. Official trailer for Uma, produced by Sam Raimi. Let's go. I think there's something wrong. Mother, is that what? Mom. Um, what is this? Uma, Uma. We need more colonies. But that's a lot more work. But it's nothing the two of us can't handle together. Damn, a lot of people go, oh, that's uh, Sam Raimi. Do you even have a phone? Studio, yeah. I guess. So how do you talk to your friends? A production company. My mom is my friend. She done been in some... Stop. No, it sounded like the grudge. What the hell? Who's going on? Just a in the picture, she looked like she ain't like she ain't with the shits at all. For <laughs> real. Why? Some Koreans believe that life's hardships are caused by the tormented spirits of their ancestors. Amanda, <laughs> you okay? Some conjuring shit right there. Is this what you want? A final resting place? Hey, you already know this about to make a me oh shit. Here we go. I already see what this going. I was getting a little bit of some grudge vibes from that, but um, like I said, being that's produced by Sam Raimi, it actually does look interesting, like I said, and I'm pretty sure it's a lot more going on than the trailer's giving off. Look like it's going to have a lot of good scary moments in there, especially, like I said, being produced by Sam Raimi. Other than that, as far as the story go, that's one of the more interesting things. I gotta be honest, uh, I'm trying to think if I've seen really like horror movies that's done this type of thing before. It was um, one movie. I don't think it was like this though. What was that movie called? Ma or Mama? Not, no pun intended as far as this being called Mother or Umma or whatever it's supposed to be called. I, I was about to say, is that supposed to, never mind. But anyway, like I said, it's trying to give me the grudge vibes. Even from this thumbnail right here, it's giving me like grudge vibes or even uh, one missed call or those other ones that they was trying to do as far as possessions or evil entities that can't find a resting spot that always come back angry or mad or something like that like i said with the grudge or what's the other one it's another one that does something like that it's not the grudge i forgot what it is right now but it does giving me those vibes but anyway 
y'all let me know how y'all feeling about this um, new movie that's coming out called Uma March 18th that's produced by Sam Raimi do y'all think it's going to have some good scares do you think it's even going to be scary do you think it's even going to be good let me know in the comment section man hit that like button hit that subscribe button if you're not subscribed to the channel don't forget to hit that notification bell to let you know when I upload new videos this is the road to 500 subs shout out to everybody who's been taking time just to watch me I do appreciate it yeah I don't feel comfortable unless I know I went above and beyond with my preparation. The things that possibly could happen, if I ain't take real steps to prevent those things, I'm not comfortable. I can't walk around, you know, charismatic and happy. Nah, I gotta make sure, you know, we setting up some type of wealth because